Excuse me, Jacks. Ah. Well, good morning. Um, what am I gonna make a video about today? I have no idea. Sometimes I run into these, um, I run into these little situations where I'm like, I have no idea what to make a video about. But I do know this. Uh, it is January, and I'm outside, uh, not necessarily in shorts and a t-shirt, but it's like 60 degrees out here, and I think it's gonna get to 70s later. The sun is shining, it's a beautiful day. So, uh, yeah, here's just some random stuff I do in Florida. Okay, so we are by the Sunshine Bridge over here. I think I forgot to kill my engine. How on earth did I manage to do that? I swear to God. Anyways, um, yeah, so we just went over the Sunshine Bridge and we're over here on the south end of the bridge. So. Um, when you go over the bridge, there's there's a north end and then there's a south end. Um, on the north end and south end, there's these rest stops. You can pull off and you got a rest stop. But what's really cool with these rest stops is you got these beautiful areas like this. We're literally right like on the mouth of Tampa Bay. Um, and there's also a fishing pier. Uh, it, it's the old Tampa Bay uh, Tampa Bay Bridge. Well, um, they turned into a fishing pier. So there's the north side and then there's the south side. Well, it turns out on the south side, and I didn't know this, we actually learned this like I think it was last year, uh, two years ago on the last Florida series, I think I wanna say it was the last video, I forget which, Keith and I took a motorcycle ride over here. Um, it's all on the videos if you go back and take a look. And we found out that you can actually spend the night here in an RV and people do it all the time. I didn't know that at the time. We thought, you know, because on the north side you can't. There's no overnight parking, but on the south side it's two different counties. Right now we're on the south side. This is Vanity County. On the north side is Pinellas County. So now, of course, I want to spend the night here. <laughs> Tell me, this is like a van lifer's paradise, right? Check out this thing. Forty Connelliner. I might go back to the Econoliner one day, I don't know. I love my transit and everything, but something about those Econoliners. Anyways, um, yeah, we're just gonna make some sandwiches here and uh, hang out, so yeah. So we just rode the bicycles. And we're at the rest stop on the south end now, but we're like on the other side. So here is actual Tampa Bay. The other side over there was the Gulf side. The city of Tampa Bay is actually way over there. I don't know if you can see or not, you probably can't, but it's like way over there. You see a bunch of skyscrapers. And then the city of uh, St. Petersburg is just over there. And there's the good old, right there, the Sunshine Bridge. So for the last like few months, honestly even longer, I think most of 2023, um, my window was not working. 2015, it's not that year, it's not that old. And my window doesn't work. 
So I tried replacing this little part, uh, the switch and all that, and it still didn't work. Turns out, uh, I did a little research, and I guess it's a common thing on these vehicles. Um, when you open and close the door, there's a pinch point there, and after ripping the whole damn thing apart and trying to find where the broken wire is or what the issue is, I finally found it where it would make sense where it'd be. So I ended up uh, cutting uh, all the wires back that were broken and just took some wire and made little jumpers and rewired them. So now I have a, uh, a working window again. Also, I uh, had to replace my starter. Uh, my starter, it was just downpouring. Uh, we were parked up at Keith's aunt's place, or an uncle, aunt, aunt's and uncle's place, and it was just downpouring all night. And in the morning, I went to start the van, and it just dun dun. And um, so, luckily, I keep a spare starter in the van, and I was able to get it swapped out fairly quickly. I didn't get any footage of it because I was just kind of irritated. So, um, I was able to also, the starter that was there uh, was under warranty, so I was able to get a new one. Uh, so I have a new one as a backup, again. So when it comes to these Ford Transits, uh, just with my experience, have some spare parts because these things, I don't know, I think they kind of suck. All right, well, in uh, just outside uh, downtown Tampa Bay over here, there is a Hard Rock Casino. Here we go. Casino, baby, hit that dice. All right, here's a little quick rant. Um, I've been to a lot of casinos. Not all of them have parking garages. And a lot of them have just regular parking lots. So if you have a short vehicle, go in the damn parking garage. Look at this. There's a short vehicle, short vehicle, barely short found vehicle. a spot. We can barely find a spot, but when you have a parking garage like that, and you have a short vehicle, go in there. Because this is for higher vehicles and trucks that can't go in there. I don't know why people do this. It doesn't make any sense to me. So anyways, here's the Hard Rock Casino. Well, anyways, we've been here for like two, two and a half weeks now, and we officially moved over to Fort DeSoto. So the next video, will you'll probably see a little bit more. Oh boy, there he is running around. Come on, come on. Jump, jump, jump. Watch him go straight in the van. Jump, 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 jump. Ah, he's not listening. <laughs> anyways, um, yeah, so. I got a couple ideas for some videos here, the next couple of videos, and uh, I'm just gonna roll with it. So anyways, uh, thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. If you made it this far, you're the weirdo watching me just do weird Florida stuff, not me. Anyways, yeah, thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Keep it simple, keep it real. I'll see you guys in the next one. Sitting in here watching old Midwest family videos, how weird <laughs> am I?